Okay, Chance, so this is the video you've been waiting for. We got the house behind the aspen trees, big garage around the side. Take up a close up of the lawn. Looks like hell right now. Bunch of bare spots. But as you can see, <clears throat> I think that uh, weed and feed has been working. The little bitches are dying. So that's all good. Then we've got that big monstrosity off the side of the house. That big bush. But let's uh, walk inside here. Little front porch action. Some boxwoods out front. And uh, one lazy tulip. Okay. And we're inside. So, this is actually our first day with Amy and I both here. So, shit isn't unpacked yet. But, this is the first room. Get can lights. Pretty decent size. Little closet off to the side here for coats. And then, so if you walk straight through this room, you get to the hallway. And then on the left is the kitchen. We've got a big closet here. It's uh, probably about two feet deep. Then, get the bathroom. So the tile doesn't go all the way to the ceiling. <clears throat> and there's no lip up top there like we were talking about earlier. Um, yeah, of course we need to take care of the vanity. Toity. And then just wall. Uh, this room has a bunch of boxes in it, but you can get a feel for it at least. So, it's a smaller bedroom, as you can tell, but uh, it's got a nice little closet and a shit ton of boxes right now. Then, little hall storage built in right there. Then the master, well, what we're the biggest bedroom upstairs, we'll say, so we've been using this as our bedroom. Decent sized closet. <clears throat> and the bed, all that stuff. Okay. Now, to the kitchen. So, you walk in the kitchen from the hallway, you get the dark tiles, big refrigerator. And there's that uh, edge up there. And then we got a little coffee bar that we uh, set up. The rest of that. Yeah. We nice to get a gas grill eventually, or caress, gas uh, range. Microwave above. You go around the corner and We've got our liquor collection, some more cabinets, a little pantry there, and then Amy had to take off, so our breakfast is still on the table, but a uh, little breakfast nook over there too. Okay, now we'll head down the stairs to the basement. And again, a bunch of boxes. And the ceilings are right at like six foot and about either one or about half an inch. Not not too much higher than my head. Um, this is the bedroom. That's immediately off the stairs when you get down 
to the basement. We haven't set it up yet, but it's actually, it's probably bigger than the bedroom we're using upstairs. It's just that the closet's a funny height. So, once you go in here, it gets a little bit taller. But, as you can tell, like, there's the top of the doorway. You bend down, and then, I don't know, it's a decent size in here. And this one wall is on a bit of an angle, which is kind of funny. You tell the wall of the door, and you've got your stairs behind that wall. Um, kind of main room down here for right now. A little closet in there. And then, you get the mother-in-law suite, which I don't know, probably just tear out. The one thing that is nice for everyone to do anything is actually a 220 outlet right behind that cabinet. So, I don't know, hot tub downstairs? We'll see. Okay, then we've got the downstairs bathroom. Still pretty bare bones right now. We haven't spent pretty much any time down here. I did do some caulking in here yesterday. You got an awesome cock job. Damn, that looks good. And then, exhaust fan, little cabinets, toilet. It does have two heating lamps on the ceiling, which would be nice in the winter down here, I'm sure. Because it will be chilly. Okay, and then the last room, you get the laundry, which is obviously unfinished, as you can tell. And you got furnace. Actually, that guy's a humidifier, which is nice for the dry weather out here. So gas furnace, and then a gas water heater. That we need to get an expansion tank for, actually. And then, I think that's our water softener, which is not being used right now. And then, I'm not exactly sure what that cylinder is. Um, and then there's some more storage under the stairs in both directions. It's not very exciting. Um, got some big shelves down here for all sorts of good stuff. Well, that's basically the house. So, now you just need to get your white ass out here and come take a look at it yourself. See you, man.